Climate change is causing temperatures to rise, allowing mosquitoes, ticks and fleas to move into new areas. Could they bring diseases with them? And is the world ready to deal with this looming threat? Wet weather and high temperatures, this year's global heat wave was the ideal environment for many lethal organisms. In warm, damp conditions, mosquitoes have the perfect breeding ground, but drought can also increase breeding, with mosquitoes attracted to water stored in domestic containers. A higher population of mosquitoes means there's growing potential for epidemics. This year, EU member states reported 710 cases of West Nile fever by the end of August. Italy, Greece, Romania and Hungary have the highest rates. In the United States, the number of people who've contracted diseases transmitted by mosquito, ticks and flea bites more than tripled from 2004 to 2016. And experts are worried about whether the population can cope with the introduction of new viruses. There's no immunity at all in the population and secondly there are lots of mosquitoes and the right sorts of mosquitoes in South America and so once the virus got into that population it could spread very rapidly. With increased global travel some experts fear people could become more exposed to tropical diseases but scientists are working on new models to predict future epidemics. If they succeed, it could help public health bodies prepare for outbreaks. As the climate changes, disease-carrying organisms could soon spread beyond their current natural habitats. Could we see parts of the world facing new diseases usually reserved for tropical climates? And are authorities ready for this possible threat?